expert noticed something unusual. I was traveling southbound on Roundhouse Road, just approaching Highway 70, uh, crest of the hill, and I just saw a shopping cart come rolling out of the Dollar General parking lot. He quickly realized something was horribly wrong. Right here is when I kind of started to see the cart moving, and then I realized there was a child, and then right about here. And he was wearing a bright yellow jacket, and he was sitting in the, the little seat in the front. A woman had been placing her other child in her car when her shopping cart carrying her young infant son started to roll away from her down the driveway and right into traffic along a busy stretch of Highway 70. My immediate reaction was it was traveling fast and so I knew there wasn't an option to stop the cart but I had to do something to try to stop traffic because it was heading directly towards a busy highway. So just activated my emergency lights and, and drove the squad on the highway to, in hopes of trying to stop traffic. It was my only option at that point. He quickly ran after the cart and grabbed the little boy, who amazingly was uninjured. Then the mother had met me down at the bottom of the hill. She was running pretty fast down the hill herself, so she was just hysterical. It's not often that officers have uh, something like that happen uh, right in front of them, but he was at the right place at the right time, but he still had to take action quick action to possibly save that child's life. The part-time police officer received a commendation from the Spooner Police Department. To take the squad car down there with the lights on, you know, not knowing what's coming for traffic, and get in front of the child, I mean, that's, uh, he could have put himself in danger. But he says he just did what anyone would have done. I believe I did anything, or the same thing any citizen or police officer would do when they saw a child in need of help. I just reacted, I guess, like any citizen. I just had the aid of emergency lights and, and was in the right place. And even though he doesn't have any kids of his own, he says he does think of his nieces and nephews. Yeah, you want to go home and hug them a little tighter after an incident like that.